relationship. What are they? Who are they to each other? Landlord. Landlord and tenant. Wow. Okay. Okay. Uh, Yay! <laughs> <laughs> yes, Billy, you are fixing the side of this apartment complex because you did not pay rent on time again. I know. I'm just like so overcome and choked up with your willingness to help me out. Yeah, I'm generous like that, Billy. <laughs> You are Dr. Sandberg. <laughs> Ever since you, uh, you delivered me from the hospital and uh, uh, bought this whole apartment complex, I know you feel an obligation to help me. Because you always help the kids you deliver. And I want you to know I don't take it for granted. One of these days I'm going to pay you rent. I hope so, Billy, because I brought you into this world, and I can certainly pick you out. <laughs> I certainly hope so, Billy, because I'd hate to have to tell your mama that you are irresponsible. New choice. <laughs> I certainly hope so, Billy, because I'm not going to put out anymore <laughs> until you start paying the rent. <laughs> well, now you're crossing the line. <laughs> You're threatening me? Yeah. Listen, Dr. Sandberg. <laughs> we had an unspoken deal when I was on that delivery table. <laughs> I thought you were going to raise me, house me, and put out. <laughs> One of those things is off the table, they're all off the table. Wait a minute. <laughs> I didn't mean that. I mean, if one of those things is off the table, then the universe is off balance, <laughs> and you will pay the dear price by never delivering a healthy baby again. What? How dare you curse me with that horrible... Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> Billy, you're a, a horrible demon! That's right. Uh, this is not the boy I delivered and then put out for. <laughs> Something's in me changed, Dr. Sandberg. It's from spending night after night in your cockroach-fested apartment. Your choice. It's uh, spending night after night in your loving arms. <laughs> it's for spending night after night just dreaming of fountains of chocolate and strawberry. Oh my god. Oh my god. The fountains, the fountains of chocolate and strawberry. That you promised would be at our way. <laughs> they never came to fruition, just like my rent. <laughs> but if you just started paying your rent, I could actually afford to buy the fountain and, and put Nestle Toll House morsels in it. <laughs> Melt it and let, let its gooey chocolate drip down the fountain. And our guests at our wedding can dip their strawberries in it. New choice. <laughs> <laughs> Guests at their weddings can dip their fingers in it. <laughs> that's, that sounds really expensive. <laughs> you really think my rent would cover all that? <laughs> you know what? If it's gonna make our fantasy come true, I'll pay you. Well, thank God. <laughs>